This is called a Kothan mug, and it's inspired by ancient Spartan warriors. Every mug is handmade by me from stoneware clay. This video will show you the steps from start to finish of how I handcraft each mug, but more importantly, it'll tell you why it's important to make new art inspired by old ideas. I start by wedging clay to remove air bubbles and get the clay to a good consistency. Then I weigh out balls of clay and hop onto the pottery kick wheel. I like using old styles of kick wheels that were invented before electricity because I like thinking about how people have been making pottery for thousands of years. The shape and design of this mug came out of conversations with author Stephen Pressfield. Stephen writes about ancient Spartan warrior culture in many of his world-renowned books, Gates of Fire, The Warrior Ethos, and more. Stephen found the Kothan while researching ancient battle equipment. He found a 2,000-year-old passage from the philosopher Plutarch. It wasn't about shields or swords or armor, but a common drinking mug. Plutarch wrote, The Spartan Kothan, or drinking cup, is especially valued for its use on military campaigns. Visually off-putting elements in a stream or river water, which had to be drunk, were concealed by its color, while dirt in the liquid was trapped in the lip, so that what reached the mouth for drinking was cleaner. No one today knows exactly what the mug looked like, but Stephen challenged me to make a new one that would be relevant for people to use today, while still being inspired by the ancient mug Spartan warriors actually used. I thought it sounded fun, so I made a mug with a wide base and a form tapering inward to a compact lip. On the outside, I added a design inspired by the Spartan battle shields, which bore the Greek letter Lambda. Lambda stood for Laconia, or Lacedaemon, the region in Greece where Sparta was the principal city. These shields became a symbol of pride for the warriors of Sparta and an emblem of terror for any force that had to face them on the battlefield. The large handles are also made from stoneware clay. I rough up the surface before attaching them because this guarantees that the handles are attached properly, but it also fits the style of these mugs. They should feel rough with textures and dents inspired by the chaos of war. I also add a thumb spot for comfort and leverage, just part of my own design. Once they're dry, the mugs get fired in a kiln up to 2000 degrees Fahrenheit. The kiln firing transforms the clay into ceramic. Ceramic is hard, it can't break down, so now the mugs are ready to get colored with glaze. Glaze is kind of like paint, except you can't eat and drink from paint. Glaze is different because it gets fired in a kiln again, which makes it non-toxic and dishwasher safe. I used a red glaze inspired by the scarlet cloaks that the warriors of Lacedaemon wore to war. The color was meant to obscure the sight of blood, so that if an individual Spartan was wounded, his incapacity would be hidden from the enemy. Next, I pour a brown glaze inside, which will actually turn black in the second kiln firing. Stephen Pressfield and I decided that the interior should be black, inspired by Plutarch's quote, which told how the mugs helped hide visibly off-putting elements in a stream or river water which had to be drunk by soldiers. After a quick dip in a clear glaze, I wipe the bottom of the mug so the mug won't stick to the kiln shelf during the second firing. After hours of tedious, repetitive work, the mugs are ready for the second and final kiln firing. I stack the mugs in a kiln, close together but without touching. Then the kiln uses electricity to fire up to 2,300 degrees Fahrenheit. The firing takes about two days, and it transforms the clay and glaze into a finished mug, ready to be used and enjoyed. What does any of this have to do with our own lives? People in modern society fight a different kind of war. External battles are now mostly internal, but I believe that these are equally as difficult. Today, most of us will never drink from mud puddles or be called upon to forage under combat conditions for the necessities of life. But we all face harrowing battles in our own lives. Pain, injustice, even death. This mug lets you drink your morning coffee inspired by the superior equipment, training, discipline, and fearlessness of the ancient Spartans.